Yo, what's up, y'all? So I'm back. Um, look at this. Yeah, man. I finally got this damn tank finished. Oh, besides the UV light I need up here, but I finally got it finished. So it's all done. Look real good, man. It looked real good. Found uh, my plant. That's the bromeliad. I found just one, but I found two. And I redid my toke tank. But before we get to this tank, let's go back to the day gecko tank. All right, so the other day I went and got this, uh, well, I was looking for a bromeliad plant and I went to a couple of places, couldn't find one and I was getting pissed. So I uh, ended up going to uh, Home Depot and I went in there and went into their plant section and they had a shit load of, load of them uh, there. So I went and picked me up too. And then I went and got some uh, some more moss. Uh, not spat no moss, but this is a, uh, what's it called, a uh, terrarium moss. So I went and got some of that from, uh, I think it was like Pet Smart, Petco, one of them motherfuckers, and uh, put that down there, and that, and, that, and that looked real good. That looked real good. So I finally finished this tank, uh, finished this tank, got that going. Look real good. I don't want to do nothing else to this but the uh, the lamp, and that'll be it. It look real good. So I, I did a real good job this tank. I'm happy the way it look. Um. So once I get that uh, that lamp with the U uh, U UVB, damn, can't talk. Uh. I can get me a um, a gecko. Now, to this tank, the Toke tank. Uh, I did a lot of new changes to this tank. I uh, put some bamboo in here, got some spat and moss up top. You see. Look real good. Got the bromeliad. Um, Open this up. Now when I got this, uh, it's not moss, but it's kind of like a, it's like a substrate cover. It's green. Uh, pick some of that up, but I don't know if I like it though, man. It's like, I don't know. Kind of like broccoli. I don't know. I don't really like it. I think I'm thinking about taking it out of here. Uh, a colorful ass uh, tank. I don't know if it's too much. I know my toke, he don't like it at all. He been hiding in his fucking tube all damn day. See, I'm down up in there. He just had a shed, so uh, he been hiding out in there all damn day. Hasn't really been out. And I'm thinking he don't really like the uh, new setup, but I mean, I like it besides that fucking, this green broccoli down here, I don't know. I'm not like, you know, taking that shit out. I don't like it at all, but uh, yeah, I found that bromeliad plant. Got the bamboo up there, and then here on the side, uh, I got him a little hide. I took that, this hat that was in the middle there, and put it here on the side. He has somewhere to go, but he's been hanging out in that uh, this little tube here. He is not liking that motherfucker the way I moved it around. And it was crazy as I was uh, redoing this fucking tank, he kind of stayed out of my way. He didn't really fuck with me. I thought he was gonna try to bite me, but he didn't. But uh, he shot up it up in there in that tube and kind of kept to itself. But um, kind of pleased the way 
these two tanks turned out, especially this one. I did a pretty good job with this tank. And I think uh, sometime tomorrow, I think I'm taking this shit out. It's late at night now. I mean, it's not late, it's uh, 10.45, but uh, I think tomorrow, tomorrow morning, I'm gonna take this shit out. I don't know if I'm gonna do spag moss back down here at the bottom. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do, but I don't really like it. Just a little too much, in my opinion. I don't know. I'll figure it out. But, uh, tomorrow I'm gonna take this shit out and then I'll uh, get back with y'all and show y'all what I did. I think I'm just doing spag moss. So I got some back there, so I might just take this out and put spag moss back all the way back around. I don't know. I'm just not feeling it. When I first put it up there, I was like, yeah, it looked good, but now that I'm been looking at it, I don't really like it, so I don't know. But this goddamn day gecko tank turned out good. So I don't really need to do nothing else to this tank but buy another lamp and uh, that'll be it. So uh, in the morning, I'm gonna get up, I'm gonna take this shit out and uh, I'm gonna show y'all how it's gonna look after I take it out. All right y'all, so uh, uh, I took that green shit out. I wanted to get it out majority of it anyway it's just a little bit left around but I mean for the most part is out and this motherfucker here he got a piece of uh, a little bit of his shit still like on the tip of his nose not kind of don't know how I'm gonna uh, get that off them might just spray him down and hopefully uh, It'll pill off. But I had a little episode with this motherfucker. Um, I was taking this shit out. Um, he was up there, and and I was down here, you know, taking all, taking that green shit out, whatever. And then uh, I looked back up, and he wasn't up there no more. So I was like, well, where the fuck did he go? So I looked in that fucking tube back there and I looked behind here in this fucking hive and looked all the way around the plant and whatever and I couldn't find it. So I'm like, okay, so where the fuck did this motherfucker go? So I uh, was fucking looking around, whatever, whatever, and I just noticed that he just wasn't in here no more. So I was like, what the fuck? So I was like, all right. So I'm thinking now that he got out. So I go over to this side of the fucking tank, looking over here in this darker area or whatever. And I come back around and this motherfucker's sitting right here. And I was like, oh shit. So, I kind of uh, eased back. I didn't want to grab him because I didn't want him to fucking, you know, take off running or whatever. So I end up uh, opening up this fucking door kind of slightly like this. And uh, he kind of jumped on the top of here. And I opened it all the way. And then he shot back in the fucking tank. So that was like a big fucking uh, breather that I didn't have to fucking chase his ass all over around the fucking house to get him back in here and then including maybe possible getting bit so uh, that turned out uh, perfect that he didn't fucking take off running on my ass but um, his ass is back in there so 
now I'm gonna have to keep an eye on him when I'm in here, you know, cleaning it and uh, you know spraying it down with him. But he got that piece of the little white piece of uh, shed still on his fucking tip of his nose. I gotta figure out a way to get that out of there. So I don't know. But uh, yeah, I got all that green shit out, so it, it looks better. I don't, I'm not sure if I'm gonna put spag the moss back down here at the bottom. I might just leave it bare like that. I mean, it ain't gonna hurt, so just leave it like that. But yeah, man, that was a close call. So, that'd be pretty much it for this fucking tank. Uh, about in another week or so, I'll be getting it. Uh, Dave Gecko for this So be looking out for that video. I kind of do like an unboxing video So be looking out for that All right, well that'll pretty much Do it for this video uh, You know as always give a thumbs up uh, If you're new to this channel go ahead and hit the subscribe button Like the video comment Got any questions? Leave it down in the comment section. And I'll see y'all next time. Alright, I'm out.